If you are more a fan of soaps than sports like me, sit tight because we're about to Skype Dr. Cooper off home and away. Kyle Pryor moved to New Zealand from the UK and soon became a citizen here. Breaking onto screens in Spartacus, he's had roles in everything from Legend of the Seeker to Go Girls. Now he plays Nate Cooper on the steamy set of Home and Away. And joining us now from his home is Kyle. Thank you for taking time to talk to us on one of your days off as well. No problem at all. Thanks for having me. Now, people know you as Nate Cooper on Home and Away. Can you tell us what's coming up this year? Yeah, of course, uh, lots of drama. Uh, you'd expect none, nothing less than that. But um, yeah, so obviously uh, the, the season return is going to be the aftermath of the bus crash. So it's, it's really going to be leaving people hanging as to who makes it and who doesn't. So and who can save the day. Hanging on the edge of their seats. Now, you worked in New Zealand for a long time and you're a Kiwi citizen officially now. So congratulations. Thank you. Thank Does you. that mean um, that you prefer New Zealand to Australia? Oh, of course, of course I do. Look, um, my my formative years were really in New Zealand, and um, it's where I got my my foundation in acting and obviously stunt work in the past as well. And you know, all my friends are there, and, and I love New Zealand. Yeah, I, I've, it's a special place in my heart for NZ for sure. And I mean, are you going to become an Australian citizen next, and then take over the whole world? What's your Maybe. plan? We'll see. We'll see what happens, definitely. Um, I'll be here for a, a bit longer as well, so um, I'll look into it and, and see what, what happens. Yeah. And you mentioned that you, you've done some stunt work. You actually worked as a stuntman before. What's it like being on the Home and Away set, and do you get to do your own stunts on the show? Do you drive your own motorbike? I, de I do get to ride the motorbike, which is uh, definitely fun for me. It's always nice when those scenes come up. Um, and also, obviously, when we get to the end of, of the season, the, the season finale, we usually have something dramatic going on, so I'll get to do a bit of stunts here and there when uh, when that comes around. But um, they usually only just give me like a little taster because, um, yeah, they don't want to risk the actors too much. So, um, But I get to kind of, you know, pull a little bit here and there out of the stunt bag, which is always good fun. Once you're an actor, the, the face is too valuable. They don't want you to damage your face. Exactly. Don't touch the face. Save it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. And you're also, you've got a black belt in Taekwondo. How do you have so much time for all these extracurricular activities of yours? Well, that's a really good question. Um, I, I don't really know, but um, I started years ago. Uh, when I was a kid, I was a very active kid. and. And growing up, I had a very strong interest in, in different uh, elements of performance, really. So I tried martial arts, I tried music, and, and even circus and juggling skills, all sorts. So I was just very interested in that, that world. So, And it's paid off for you as well. Now, a lot of actors have, have had really interesting kind of career paths leading up to acting. And we want to play a bit of a game with you called Prior Professions. Hey, okay, nice. Came like up it. with that myself, because you know your last name's Prior. Perfect. Yeah, you get it. Okay, so um, here's some celebrities, and I want you to guess which of these jobs they did before they were famous. Okay, okay. cool. So George Clooney, was he a door-to-door -door insurance salesman or a chartered accountant? I think I know this one. I think he was a door-to-door -door salesman. He was. Well done. Okay, one from one. Christopher Walken. He's quite a strange guy, and so I'm sure these won't surprise you. He was either a rodeo clown or a lion tamer. No oh, joke. Wow. Um, well, that's pretty well. Let's go for the clown. Okay, that's probably the natural choice, but he was actually a lion tamer before wow. he before he became famous. Okay, Hugh Jackman. Yep. Very famous Aussie. Was he a PE teacher or a theatre teacher? Before I Wolverine. PE. PE. Yeah. Yes, well done. Okay, two from three. Let's see if you can get three from four. Jennifer Lawrence, was she an assistant nurse at a summer camp or a junior lifesaver? Let's go junior lifesaver. Did you say nurse? I did say nurse. Definitely yeah, nurse. well done. A very impressive score <laughs> at that. Thank you so much for talking to us, especially on your day off. Go oh, enjoy the rest of your time off. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me, and, and thanks to everyone for watching, and I hope you like the season return. What a nice guy. If you're a fan, you can follow him on Facebook and Twitter. Come oh, on. Oh, Calm down. I was Breathe. a little bit flustered because he's, he's very good looking. <laughs> Just Kyle. a little bit of dribble. Right. No, he was a good looking man. Don't blame me.